Where's the tenth one? All right, I just did attempt number one. Oh, I'm out of breath a little bit. I'm gonna head back up, maybe give it a little more go before I finish just doing my normal run. I'm pretty sure I beat my fastest time down that steep section. Um, I forgot what that segment's called. Is it fair if, if which the king of the mountain time is still like on the 30 seconds faster than what I did yesterday? If I beat it, is it fair that I beat it in the snow conditions? I think the current king of the mountain was during summer. The snow, while it's cold, definitely adds a uh, part to it that makes it easier. Mainly because you can just jump and just plant your feet down. I'm not, I guess, really wanting to take king of the mountain that way, but I'm okay with beating my time this way. It's definitely faster than my time yesterday. I don't know if it was faster than my first time today. We'll find out. For now, I gotta go back up and do some more. We are at the two summits only at 1.7, about 784 feet of gain. I'm not concerned about mileage today. Just really wanna get uh, 2,000, 2,500 feet of climbing in. So I've got at least another two to three laps this away so I can focus now. All right, I'm checking to see how I got those two. Either one of those two, I can't talk right now. 
I'm checking to see if any of those. All right, definitely beat my fastest time. Oh, so close. My fastest now is 237. The all time is 231. No spots that I can go faster, but I think I'm gonna be happy with this. It looks like he did it in June of 2020. So I would rather beat that KOM while doing it uh, in the summer. So I don't have like the snow advantage, which I really think that the snow is definitely creating some type of an advantage. Let's see how Koros breaks it down. Uh, there's my uh, run. I don't know if you can see it. Uh, just over 2,000 feet of gain, 4.36 miles. Um, this section right here kind of added up some of the mileage. We've just gone straight up and down for the most part and got a lot more gain. Different ways get you different gain, obviously. I found the one that will give me the most gain is about 550 to 560. It's a little bit longer. It's about a half mile up where the direct way is like less than a quarter mile up, but you don't get the same gain. Let's see what temperature it is outside right now. Eh, only 28. Uh, yesterday, when I started, it was like 10 degrees. So it's definitely warmer today. Uh, we will revisit this in the summertime and see if I can get it legitimately. Definitely some improvement in my snow capabilities compared to the last video, but the last video is more exploring. Now I'm a lot more comfortable. So this that wraps up this video. The quest to beat my fastest time, but just slow enough to not take the KOM.